happening? What's going on, kids? What's going on? What's going on? Yes, you know, I, I feel, I'm excited. I, I'm you know, excited. I'm, I'm in, I'm I'm in the presence. Man, this is awesome. <laughs> Look, you guys. Now, you know, I got to brag a little bit because Kitsch, um, we played uh, one of your sounds before Drake, on our rotation yeah. playlist. Drake. Yeah, yeah. So for all the listeners out there, I'm sure you guys have heard of Kitsch. I'm sure you guys have heard of Drink because we have played his songs a couple of times on our playlist. Right, right. So now he's going to be hanging out with us. And I want to steal the show because I got so much to speak about. But go I'm ahead, not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Yeah. <laughs> now look, you guys. Now Kitch is going to be performing on March the 9th. And he's doing a pre-open mic interview. We want to highlight some of the hottest artists. Yes. And um, we're just excited to have you. I'm excited to be yeah, here. What prompted you to get into the hip-hop scene, the rap scene? Um, I've been doing music for a while. I come from a very, uh, my family's been into music for a while. My grandfather was a preacher, so I've been around music for uh, days. Okay. Um, I actually got into the music, a funny story. Remember the Jesper Me tapes used to come in the box? Yes. <laughs> we used yes. to record off of those. Oh. And it just kept growing and growing, and, and I'm here now. I had the privilege of uh, hanging with uh, DJ Big Cap. If you don't know who that is, that biggest DJ. Okay, and okay. I had a, a privilege of being under him for, for about a year before he passed. Okay. And I, I really started learning more about the music, uh -huh. more or less just record. Okay, so okay. So after that, it's been take off since then. Wow, that's amazing. Yes. Now, um, you, you spoke that your father? My grandfather. Your grandfather yes. is a minister, a preacher. Yes, now, let me ask you. Now, what, what was his thought process when his grandson got into rap? What's, what's well, going on with that? Well, he passed away with my grandmother. She's excited about it. Okay, so she approves. Yeah, she's approved. Okay. Uh, I think I make pretty good quality music. Yeah. I do... I don't just do like the trap money thing. I, I, I do a little bit of everything, so you're not gonna be able to box me in. Okay. So okay. I can do it all. Cause you know, I, I did pay attention to your lyrics, and I think that was Dream. Was it Dreams? Probably Dreams. And 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 I said, okay, he's lyrically <laughs> conscious. Yes. You. That's okay. <laughs> hey, you're in the ATL. It's kind of hard yes, to communicate. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And with the traveling back and forth, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. Yes. It's crazy. But look, I am excited, and I'm not gonna keep our listeners just kind of like you know in limbo because we got we we got. Want to kitchen sounds, you guys? We're gonna yes. we're gonna put it. We're gonna spin it on the air and let you guys check it out. Tell us about this track that's coming up alone. Let the let us know. You know what what was the the methodology or your, your thought process behind the creation of alone? Actually, I did alone. Um, I, I wrote alone. Actually, probably about six months ago. Oh, that's um, fresh. Okay. Yeah, I did. Uh, I recorded in uh, Greenlight Studios in Augusta, Georgia. Okay. And uh, I did a particular uh, record. Um, at a certain time period in the city, I'm from Watley, Georgia. How y'all doing? Okay. Um, it's like a ghost town. Wow. So I got in this car and I rode around and just seen different things in the city, man. Uh -huh. And I wrote this particular record while I was driving. Everything that I wanted to get away from mm -hmm. out of that small town, uh -huh. I happened to run into it, still in Atlanta. Uh, again. Again. Yeah. Yeah. So I okay. think it's, 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 you know, a lot of people like it. I get, get a lot of people good feedback on okay. it. So okay. Well, I checked it out. I'm, I'm, I'm grooving to it. You're grooving to yeah, it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> well, look, you guys, you know, I'm, I'm going to tell you, I don't know how that traffic is out there right now, but I want you guys to just kind of drive safely. Keep those dials on 1570. If you're not getting a good reception, pull over. Don't try to fiddle around with your cell phones going down the road. Download that TuneIn app. Um, Cause we're about to play alone, you guys. So you do not want to change that dial. Otherwise, shame on you. Coming up, you guys, is "Alone" by Kitch himself. He's in the building. Yes. You're listening to the Underground. We are taking control.